What's up everybody? Thank you and welcome to the video today. I am in lovely, if you can see over here, Portsmouth, Virginia. And today I'm gonna show you the top five things or five places to visit while you are in Portsmouth, Virginia. you want to do in Portsmouth, Virginia is really simple. You want to go to the Children's Museum if you have kids. So here it's closed today but I'll show you some b-roll footage of it and it's pretty amazing uh, and it's a really great time suck for kids if they really want to come in here and have fun and be interactive and learn a little bit about the town, the history, and also uh, just a lot of fun stuff to do inside. And that's my number five thing to do in Portsmouth, Virginia. Number four is coming up. Thing you want to do is definitely ride the ferry over to Norfolk to Waterside and then ride it back. And there you can see the ferry. I believe it is two dollars for a one-way fare. Make sure you bring extra change. And for two dollars it's a really nice way to get away from Portsmouth and enjoy the water without having to go all the way to Virginia Beach. It is pretty amazing and it looks a little something like this. So riding the ferry over to Norfolk and bringing it back to Portsmouth, that's my number four thing to do. What's number three? Number three is coming up right now. My number three thing to do in Portsmouth, Virginia is to hang out here at the landing. Go to Jimmy John's, grab a sandwich and a soda and come here and watch the boats go by. It's really, really great because you can see all the ships in dry dock. And there's one, two, three, four, five, six on the other side, seven. You can also see the sailboats that are here um, just you know, spending the overnight or maybe they're gonna be here for a couple days. So that's my number three thing to do in Portsmouth, Virginia, is to hang out at the landing, grab yourself a sandwich at Jimmy John's, make a picnic, hang out, watch the boats. Number two, it's coming up. So it turns out that the number two thing to do in Portsmouth, which was really a tie between number two and one, is closed right now, but it will open shortly and I will show you that. But I do wanna give a shout out because the reason I am in Portsmouth was because I was getting some an air conditioning unit installed in my home that we own here. And the two guys that were putting it in were just amazing. So I definitely want to show you guys these two individuals that are stellar and here's a shout out. My video, let me just say thanks to these boys right here. Shout out. Magic. Shout out. And they are from, well, you gotta move your head because I can't see the van. <laughs> oh. There you go. Now, not a sponsored video, but they put in my air conditioning and they're pretty cool. And he's gonna come visit, no, he's gonna come visit me in Japan. Yes, I am. He may come. I may come. Yeah. <laughs> so if you're a uh, single Japanese and female, you might probably want to send him a lot of encouraging notices to come. No? no. Oh, him. Yes, yeah, yes. sorry, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Just send it to him, he won't care. Let's go back to the top five things to do in Portsmouth, Virginia. And these guys are freaking awesome. Thank you so much for all your help today. Yahoo! Anyway. So number two on my places to visit in Portsmouth, Virginia is the Commodore Theater. Close tie with number one, you can come to this theater and it's not like any theater you've been to. Up top on the second floor, there are seats like a normal movie theater that you'd find anywhere. But down below what they've done is they've gutted all the seats and they've actually put in tables with rolly chairs, which is fantastic. They each have a, a little light on it, like a lantern type thing, and a telephone. You pick up the telephone and you're able to order food, beer, whatever you'd like that's on the menu, and they bring you your food. Really a great place in Portsmouth that you don't want to miss. The Commodore Theater, and that's my number two. So now we've come to the number one thing to do in Portsmouth, 
Virginia, when you are in Portsmouth, Virginia, and this is the number one on my list, is you have to visit the beer garden. Beer Garden is one of the best restaurants in Portsmouth, if not the best, and they have tons of beer selections that everybody will love. And of course, there's German chocolate cake, which you should order before you eat here, before you sit down, before you even get your meal. Order the German chocolate cake because they run out. So definitely make sure you get that. And then when your dinner's done and you finish your meal, you are going to thank me a million times over. The German chocolate cake is the best in the land. And it happens right here at the Beer Garden. Here is a great addition to the beer garden. They also have a gift shop, which is uh, behind the beer garden or around the corner if you don't want to go through the bar. And they have everything. They have cups, they have glasses, they have baby stuff. Oh, I gotta get one for my son. I gotta get a shirt for my son. They have bibs, they have t-shirts, they have what you don't need in Okinawa, leases. They have hats, cool hats, uh, like so. Look good, what do you think? Yeah, maybe, maybe not. To hide balding pretty good. And if you're also homesick in German or just want to eat German food or drink German wine or just drink in general, there's lots to choose from here. Lots of champagne, lots of wine. I don't drink wine, so I'm just pointing at bottles that look like wine. And then they have, you know, obviously some German food, the Harbo candies or Haribo candies. You really will find just about anything you want German themed here at the Beer Garden gift shop. But the real reason you want to come here is the beer and the food and the beer, but mostly food and the German chocolate cake. And if you eat there, they give you a coupon for 5% off so that you can spend in the gift shop. This is number one on my five top places in Portsmouth to visit, the beer garden. I uh, took a short trip to the States from Okinawa, so here I am in Portsmouth. Thanks for watching. Remember, if you know anybody in the military, active duty, or spouse, give them a handshake or a hug, because it ain't easy. And I will see you next video.